Gaspar Agotre is a successful photographer at Lagole Trading Center, where he's established a successful photo studio. The family of Gaspar Agotre, comprising of a couple and five children, is living a simple but happy life in Lungole Magamaga in Mayuke district. But they are not an ordinary family. Both parents are HIV positive. His wife Florence was found to be HIV positive when she went for antenatal at the nearby health center. Her husband was also tested and found to be positive. The health center has a partnership with Baitambogwe Community Health Initiative, Bachi, which helps HIV positive couples to practice prevention of mother to child transmission of HIV in the area. Agotre and his wife were supported by Bachi to undertake PMTCT and now they have a healthy baby. We were advised that before we go for a conceal, we go for a, a, maybe if we, when we intend to opt to have a child, yeah? one we should first check on our CD levels to emphasize at least to check on our immunities at the time before we conceive. Yeah? Uh, uh, regular checkup, medical checkups, um, proper feeding, regular counseling, through PSS meetings that were always conducted, almost, almost twice a week, actually once a month, once a month. So, that kind of motivation you always go there. Eh? We fed the kid for the first six months on breastfeeding. Good? Exclusive Exclusive breastfeeding, of course for six months exclusively. Though of late you are told you can even go here. I'm told some other subs have come up that can sustain that. But uh, during our time, uh, it, the program was still at six months. That's exactly what we did. At six months exactly, we weaned him, put him exclusively on breast, I mean on, on milk, uh, on oral, yes, on oral milk. Mm, he had been doing, he's been doing well. Appetite has been good. And very, very few cases of malaria here and there, uh, which we consider to be normal. Mm -hmm. After successfully getting an HIV-free baby, Florence Agotre wants to have more, although her husband is more cautious. <laughs> Gaspar Agotre and his wife owe their positive outlook to life, despite their HIV status, to the work of Baitambogwe Community Health Initiative, Bachi which has been supported by CSF to reach HIV positive couples in two sub-counties with information and facilities to have HIV free children. CSF since 2009 has supported us for, for PMTCT interventions. These interventions have been uh, helping mothers to access uh, reproductive health services that do help in prevention of mother to child transmission of HIV. It also helped us in bringing up these HIV positive uh, parents and their children together to seek medical care, whatever they would be due to for. So we tested about 160 children, 162 children, and 112 were HIV negative. And uh, this was a very good success. It also helped us to, 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 to link up with the community and health facilities. Robert Chuanuka and his wife Prosi have four children and are both HIV positive and members of a support group after they have successfully used PMTCT to have two negative children after they had tested positive. Wano vajane watu sumesa abasawo mumbachi and tujira amayinja tuteka wakati amayinja ni tuteka mwetaka lidewe vintu vinji lidewe ntula kabeji 
Although Bachi has reached a number of couples who have successfully adopted PMTCT, more resources are needed nationally to reach more couples who have disillusioned lives or are ignorant of their HIV status and continue to have HIV positive babies who strain them with a big care burden. It is a bit expensive to save even one child. So funding is a major big problem. However, if funding is available, I think we can do much to help our communities.